Stratford. Stratford may look like many other towns in southern Ontario. I think that Stratford's different in that we've been blessed with visionary leaders and leaders that have a big idea. The city of Stratford is a unique place. They're always reinventing themselves. They're always looking forward to the future, where they're going. I believe there's a buzz in the city of Stratford, respecting the past, but also moving forward in the future. I often get asked, how did Stratford become such an intelligent city? I guess we should ask ourselves, why did it work 50 years ago in Stratford? Tom Patterson had a big idea to start a Shakespeare festival in a small town in Ontario. It was such an unlikely idea, but it was enormously successful. What we do here that is dramatically different is we find a way to reinvent ourselves. Fiber optic cable is the railway of today, and it needed the special treatment of being a municipal asset. Our network of 60 kilometers of fiber optics has grown over the last 18 months to include connectivity to 300 access points. These access points provide wireless connectivity to all Wi-Fi enabled devices for visitors, for citizens, for workers within the city of Stratford. The high speed data communications that's available here in Stratford allows us to connect to any of the systems anywhere we operate around the world. Our people like working here, they like living here. What makes innovation possible is that all the residents of Stratford support you and people in their endeavors. It's that Stratford way of life. We chose Stratford as our home base for Power Noodle because it had a number of elements in the ecosystem for us. One was the business community, secondly the technical community, thirdly the creative community, and finally the financial community that could be there to support us. You work together and you collaborate and you make things happen. RBC is Canada's largest financial institution and we're extremely excited to be here in Stratford building our world-class back office support facility. It will be a 350,000 square foot building and approximately $400 million investment here in the community of Stratford. The RBC selection of Stratford speaks so much to the future of our community. To know that they believe that we're the place to make such a large investment. Stratford is a learning city. Virtual learning for students was not available a few short years ago and now it's available for students who go to high school in Stratford and who go to high school anywhere in the world. Biblio College uses Web 2.0 techniques to make it easier for people to find things uh, that they're looking for. And we were the first with online learning. We were the second in the world to go live with Biblio Commons. We've been able to take advantage of lots of opportunities, for example, ebooks. Because we've always had people willing to step forward to the front, to lead, to do things that are a little different. The University of Waterloo Stratford campus is focused on research and education in the digital media and future focused space. Together, the Stratford campus and the Stratford Institute are two powerhouse brands bringing global research, education, and talent generation to the city of Stratford. I have immense pride in this community. It overwhelms me every day when I read about the achievements we've had in the past and what our bright future looks like. What we're bringing to Stratford is a unique opportunity for the youth in Stratford to actually stay here, to get their education here. The Stratford Shakespeare Festival has a real strong connection with the community of Stratford. Today we're able to offer rich media content on our website, things like interviews, um, clips from our plays, uh, behind the scenes, into the scene shop, into the costume shops. Well, Stratford, as a rural community, competes head-to-head -head with the larger centres such as Toronto for healthcare talent. As such, we have to really be punching above our weight. CSTAR allows us to link directly in with healthcare professionals in London from a telementoring perspective to help coach and mentor our staff here. Well, imaging is one of the most advanced areas when it comes to e-health. A patient can come in to see forth, can have an ultrasound, the radiologist in Stratford will read that ultrasound, and then that information from the radiologist is immediately available to the physician in c For healthcare organizations to be successful, they've really got to be able to move information from place to place. Stratford's investment in broadband technology has allowed us to do that beautifully. Stratford needs to continue reinventing itself. We've done it with so many other things from railway to manufacturing to theater arts and now digital media. It's a tapestry, it's a tapestry of um, amazing individuals. Stratford has the opportunity to go anywhere they want. But you have to be fearless in taking risks. And things happen in Stratford that don't, don't happen in many other communities across Canada or across an international stage. It's about diversity and innovation. Stratford is setting an example for other cities to follow and we're all passionate about it.